this one is history. The 1994 Hall of Fame Bowl is history. 42 to 7 Michigan and let's go down to Dr. Jerry Punch. Jerry. What a day here in Tampa, guys. 18 carries, 124 yards, and Tyrone Wheatley, two touchdowns up. Does the effort today make it easier to make a decision or tougher? Oh, well, you know, I just came out to play this ball game, and I was playing this ball game for Michigan, you know, not for me to make a decision on, on whatever, you know, to leave or to stay. You know, things are still here. My heart is at Michigan, and, uh, you know, on the bus on the bus ride back to the uh, hotel, airplane back to Michigan, my heart is still with Michigan. So I don't know, you know, I'll probably make the decision when I get back to Ann Arbor. We talked to your grandmother, Louise, and some of the family. They said they're behind you 100%. Are you getting some input from the family as to which way you should lean? Well, you know, they said it's my life, and, it's you know, I worked hard to get here, and only I should make the decision. You know, they just said they'll back me up 100% or whatever I do. Concerned at all about coming back next year? you got a great nucleus here at Michigan. How important would the Heisman Trophy be for you if you can come back and win it? It's a very, very important. It's just, it's, it's, it's right, it ranks number one along with, you know, every child's dream to play in the NFL, you know. Uh, some things go in chronological order, some things don't, you know. And, um, you know, like I said, that's just some things I have to think about when I get home. Well, you're standing here smiling, and there's a guy beside you, Gary Moeller, head coach at Michigan, who's smiling. And, Coach, uh, congratulations uh, on an outstanding effort today. Well, I think the kids had a good effort. Now, you're always concerned about that in bowl games because so you, you see so many crazy things happen, and I think we kind of regained that focus we had in the, at the end of the year, and that, that was helpful. We talked to this young man about the decision he has to make. Uh, the efforts today doesn't make it any easier. I know you probably support his decision, but uh, have you been able to give him any, any advice at all? Well, we, we've talked a little bit, but we, we aren't going to make any decisions uh, before this game. And obviously, he has, yeah, he has some decisions to make. And the biggest thing is that we make the correct decision for Tyrone Wheatley. Because if it's not in the best interest of the student athlete, why do it? The guys upstairs talked about, you know, what is a correct decision? I mean, it's hard to make one out. So, you know, what value do you put on your last year of college? Well, you put a lot on it because it's a year you can never ba buy back out of your life. And you gotta, you got to go through a number of other things and a lot of other things you might want to accomplish that's not in the NFL, and yet we all understand money. Well, money is one thing, but Heisman trophies don't come but once in a lifetime. And uh, have you talked to Desmond Howard or Hopalong Cassidy, any of the folks down here who won the Heisman? Have they told you what it means to them? I talked to some of the guys, and they said it's a very, you know, very prestigious trophy to have. You know, it's something that you can have with you for the rest of your life. And, uh, you know, like I said, I just have to make a decision when I get back to Ann Arbor. Guys, congratulations on a big victory. Thank you very much. Thank you. We'll be back to Tampa Bay. It's a Michigan win for the Wolverines, 42-7, to 7, the eighth annual Hall of Fame game here at Tampa Bay Stadium.